choked up every time when I see you perform. I know how much you want it. You are absolutely unbelievable. Thank you, Heidi. Unbelievable. <laughs> Thank you. Mel B. I'm speechless. <laughs> Honestly. It's never happened. Can I just say something? Yeah? I think this performance was in a league of its own. <laughs> Genuinely. I mean, to do that, you know, without any stops, I mean, it was dangerous, it was brilliant, and it was you just your imagination. And you. Oh, come on! So th this was my night. I'm so blessed. Mel B, what do you want to say to your new team, Mel? I mean... And your ex-friend. I mean... <sighs> I was literally speechless. And I think I still am. My golden buzzer says it all. You're just incredible. Thank you, thank you. You really are. Heidi, how do you feel right now losing Aiden? She's thrilled. Obviously, I would love for you to still be on my team, but you're in the finale, and that's most important. Yes, thank you so much for your mentor. Thank you. All right, make some noise one more time for Aiden Bryant! Oh, they are good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good. They're really good. Here are the Ramadani brothers, and I mean, I'm already so excited because you can see already, everyone is so excited yeah. to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. I wish you good luck. Yeah. Okay, can we just talk about this contraption? Look at this contraption. Is this your mentoring? Yes. On judgment day, I won't fade away. I'll be pushing on till my dying day. I won't give it all away. I'll be pushing on till the rivers run dry. I've got to try, try, try. That's one leg.
not try this at home! The best, the best Thank of you. the best. Thank you. Now, why would you do that? Like, you are unbelievable. There's no, there's not enough words. There's not enough words. Honestly. Thank you. Simon. For me, I like to feel that we're judging this show based on what we've seen each act do before. And I thought there must be a ceiling. And you've just broken through the ceiling. I still think you can do better. What? What? I'm gonna be honest. I think you what? can do better. Howie! You can. No, they're amazing. Hey! 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 You can do better. You can do better. Howie! You can do so much better. <laughs> with, with, oh my God. with the right, with the right.
has taken the Ramadani brothers from Heidi's dream team. <laughs> what do you want to say, Howie? You'll never have to wear lame pants again. <laughs> I wrote this song for my hero. Mom, this song is for you. Emotional now. <laughs> uh, you wrote that song for your mum, obviously. And Tina, you are like a little lioness, aren't you? <laughs> you really are. Uh, you've uh, always been there by his side. And this is the second time, obviously, in a row, Cody's now singing his own material, uh, which is a huge step up. And I am so proud of you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Heidi. What a beautiful love letter to your mother. Your appreciation, I mean, it doesn't get more heartfelt than what you've just done. It was beautiful, absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Howie, what a gift to AGT. What a gift to talent. Cody Lee, you are the biggest gift I have ever experienced on this stage. Yeah. You know, I believe that everybody on my dream team has what it takes to make it to the end. But uh, I can always use more. Oh, <laughs> 
Eric's not up for you. <laughs> Listen, this is competitive, and I don't like to give my uh, fellow uh, mentors credit. But keep it coming. Go on. But if, if tonight was my golden buzzer, I would use it on you. I definitely Thank would. Thank you. I think I'm going to have to agree with Howie, because that looked very well rehearsed and slick. Thank well you done. so much. Thank you. OK, so. I felt actually quite emotional, Sophie, because I'm seeing you grow as an artist and have the guts to come back and compete again against some of the best acts in the world and actually get better. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I have a feeling this might be your year. Thank you so much. Everything, and I don't want anyone to kerfuffle this, as Mel would say. I will give you this golden buzzer no way! right now. My dreams come alive.
on. There's only five spots only left. Five spots. Sophie Dossi, you are going straight to the AGT Fantasy League Finals. This this is so insane. I mean, I'm like speechless right now. Uh, I don't know what to say. I want to say that you did not really actually need my golden buzzer, but you know, I push it for you because I love you and I believe in you and I think you're amazing. That was great. One more time for Sophie Dossi. You know, I know for a fact that that young man at the end of the table was up till midnight clearing that song. Thank you. We asked people on this show to step it up. You just stepped it up beyond. It was amazing. I'm so proud. Mel. I really don't like you. I really don't. <laughs> That's it. They were brilliant! All right, all right, all right! Yeah. Yeah. Simon knows what's up. I just connected with you 
from that first audition. Then we spoke on the phone. And I said, how would you feel about singing my favorite song of all time, Purple Rain? And I just heard this scream. Aww. And I thought, that's a yes. <laughs> I think Prince is the greatest artist of all time. And you said it was going to be good. It wasn't. It was incredible. Yeah. <laughs> it was honestly a moment I will never, ever, ever forget. And I really pray that this moment will change your lives. And I'm going to give you something from my heart. Right now, I remember being a kid rehearsing in the mirror, pretending that we were before crowds like this. <laughs> Never stop believing, always keep dreaming. You can do it, you can make it. One more time for Satan. No, your mom don't get it, and your dad don't get it, Uncle John don't get it. And you can't tell Grandma, cause her heart can't take it, and she might not make it. They say, don't dare, don't you even go there, cutting off your long hair, you do as you're told. Tell you wake up, go put on your makeup This is just a phase you're gonna outgrow There's something wrong in the village In the village Oh, hey, stand in the village In the village But I know I am possible. Yes! Yes! There goes my heart beating to show the reason. I'm losing my sleep. He's called Musa Mota! Musa, you know, we, we met in the UK. I'll never forget the very first time I, I saw him. It was one of those, you know, moments where you just go, I will never, ever forget that. There's something so amazing about you. And you, you just, everyone I was looking around, they were captivated. And I don't think the final would be the same without you. And I, I want to give you a little hand. Oh, 
Hang on. You were so emotional, weren't you? Musa Mota, you just received the golden buzzer from Simon Cowell. You were on Simon's dream team, and you remain on Simon's dream team. Oh, what do you want to say, Musa? Oh. Uh, Thank you, Simon. <laughs> and <laughs> these are the moments where I, I think about like when I was struggling a lot in the hospital and then I kept on seeing people, you know, not making it, you know, but this is just like a manifestation of like everything that I was dreaming about is, ha is happening right now. People make some noise from Musa Mota! We are coming. like you know it's like some movie that we're watching and it's so crazy what you guys do thank you thank you so absolutely much absolutely unbelievable i love all of you so much love mel b did you like this what just happened <laughs> well i've got to <laughs> say what just happened i know you know what your dance routines and your timing and your music choice Whoa. just incredible simon this is a really Really difficult act to get right, you know? Timing, talent, showmanship, the desire to win. Yes. Uh, I mean, it's everything. Everything! Thank you so much. Make some noise for V and V the Can I just say, this is my favorite act of all time. I have never been more excited because you're on Team Howard!
business. Wait, so that literally means anybody else who's going through has to be voted by the audience. Be unbeatable! You have just been taken I from Howie's Dream Team and transferred Hi, to Heidi's Dream yeah. Team. What do you guys want to say about being on Heidi's Dream Team now and getting the golden buzzer? Thank you so much, Heidi, ma'am. We feel like we did something on stage. You but, do. But, so good. But I, I really thank to Harvey, sir. Because of you, we made this. And Simon, sir, you are father for us. Love you so much, sir. Can, can we do older brother? <laughs> Make some noise for V Unbeatable! Thank you. That was so sweet. Yeah, you deserve it. Thank you. Yeah. That's what happened. Yeah. Well, now we go straight to the finale. Oh. Finale. They're really happy to be with Heidi, though. Let's celebrate. Oh. <laughs> Hello, Billy. Hello, Emily. Hello. How are you? Very well. I'm Good. very excited. You look a little bit nervous. Yes, we are putting a lot on the line tonight, so um, the nerves are there, but it's all good. Good. Good luck. Thank you. Now you're going to see men three. Here we go, guys, clearing stage. They better be good. You've coached them. Honestly, feel this is what the show is all about. Simon's very lucky to have you in his squad. I gotta <laughs> say that this is one of the most dangerous, exciting standout acts we've ever had in Got Talent history. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Can I just 
that's it. This was spectacular. It really, really was. And you really like this act, don't you? Like them. I love them. But you know what? Guess who has the golden buzzer tonight? No, you can't. I guess that helps the Mel B Dream Team. Oh my God! You're now part of my team. You're part of my team oh, now. Why is she up there? Billy and Emily England! Mel B has given you the golden buzzer and taken you from Simon's Dream Team. They're going right to the finals, y'all. Whose team is it? Well, me. <laughs> Emily, how does this make you feel? I feel really excited. <laughs> I feel amazing. Honestly, um, when Simon called me, the 11-year-old Emily was a little bit upset. I really wanted to be part of Mel B's team. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, that's show business. Take that! Hi, my name is Vanessa, and I'm from South Pasadena. My question for Simon is, what animal do you think you look like the most? I think it's a lemur. And I remember seeing a nature program once, and I thought, that actually looks like me. Sophia! The chihuahua that you posted this morning on your Instagram story, is that yours? And do you have more? <laughs> I have two chihuahuas in my life. Oh, one oh. is my son, and the other one oh, was oh. supposed to be my dog, but she hates me and loves my husband, and she's a very bad dog. Oh, oh. And we have a question for Heidi. I would love to know what her most embarrassing moment is. I have four children, and I would say to them, everything I do is embarrassing. What do you do when you get nervous? Instead of calling it nerves, what I do is call it excitement. Please welcome your house. And I use those nerves to bring me energy. Terry Green! I got it. That is Heidi having lunch. You feel it's Heidi chewing something? Heidi chewing chips. Sounds like a hamster is eating something. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the guy crushing the nuts with his butt cheeks. Mr. Cherry, I love him. <laughs> it was hard. It really hurt. Hey, Heidi. Your hand binoculars are ridiculous. Stop it. You don't understand. They're not binoculars. Yes, they are. No. What it does, it takes the light outside from the outside. Sense. And it gets darker around, and then I can actually see better. I need to my glasses. To focus into some parts yes, sometimes. Exactly. So it's not it so bright. Because when it's so bright, I can't see what they're doing. And I need to judge. So my family and I are watching AGT and my dad says, is Beyonce always on this? It's Tyra Banks. Or is it? Blue Ivy, Blue Ivy, sit down right now. Mama gotta host this show, Blue. AGT made Simon Cowell so soft. <laughs> yes, for me. I want Simon the Savage back. The one who crushed dreams and made people cry for fun. Off. <laughs> Password is magic. Did you just look? No, not at that. Are no. you guys talking? No. <laughs> Trick. Magic. Yes! 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 Magic is the correct <laughs> word. That is cheating. Who heard him tell me the word? That's that cheating. That means that you were cheating already. <laughs> They're <laughs> cheating <laughs> because they heard you cheating. <laughs> All right, nice. this is the I'm final sweating. clue. The we clue? are actually tied at the moment, <laughs> and we are going to start with Howie. The okay. password 
is... Ready? Million. Dollars. <laughs> million. Oh! He's right! Thank That's you very it. much. Everybody. That is the word. Simon and Howie have won. Yes, I wanted to say... <laughs> Thank <laughs> you for <laughs> playing Password. Let's do it, everybody. You won a million dollars. Where's the check? Where's the check? Word do you think he's thinking of and vice versa. What do you think Howie is thinking of? One word. And when I count to three, you're going to say that word out loud. Clear your mind. Okay. This is a mind reading technique to show that you guys are in perfect sync. Okay. okay. Read her mind. Three, two, one. Yes! Earring and shoes. <laughs> Look each other deeply in the eyes, deeply. Three, two, one. Nice! Look at each other deeply. Understand each other. Three, two, one. Lipstick! <laughs> this is freaky! <laughs> Lipstick! Feel the power. Word? You have it? Yeah, yeah. You have it? I got it. Three, two, one. Handsome. handsome. What? Did y'all say handsome? Handsome! That was not, by the way. This is crazy. I handsome. swear on my life that was not prep. <laughs> I didn't plan that. We got you... studied what profession for three years? I know what it was. Dentistry, because she has amazing teeth. She's going to be a dentist. You want to know why I know that? They don't show this backstage. She will actually floss my teeth. Imagine if you turn up and guess who's your dentist, Sofia Vergara. That sounds so sexy. <laughs> It'd be like, you know what? I'll have a filling out a week. How many Emmys have I been nominated for? I'm going to say seven. Two Emmys. Seven times. Let's just go for the seven. Why are you looking at me like that? I'm guessing. I don't know. Four. <laughs> You didn't let me finish. I was going to say two times two. Well, she should have got more. The competition was brutal. The, and, and last night, we had the highest of highs and then some incredible, for me, personal disappointments. And we are here, and we are all paid, to be honest. I am brutally honest. That's why it was brutal. Good luck to everyone. But you sometimes are also grumpy. I'm not grumpy. Yeah, no, okay. And also, I'm, I'm translating. She said grumpy. Okay. Well, you they know what? Me. This is a good sign. Listen, Sophia, a lot of the judges, you guys disagreed on a lot of the acts last night. Why do you think that was? Um, well, we, well, first of all, we have different tastes. And we, we all have the same taste. Some of them don't know what they <laughs> what they what they're supposed to know. Uh, I know everything grumpy? we know. <laughs> How is grumpy sometimes, and Simon is sometimes loco, so it, there's nothing. No, I admit it. I do admit it. <laughs> no. Welcome to Buzzer Buddy. Sally, if you were cleaning out Simon's closet, what would you throw away first? If I was cleaning out Simon's uh, closet. You've got very minimal choices here, because he wears the same thing. Yes. It's, oh, uh, it's oh. between the white t-shirt <laughs> and the white dress shirt. And or the bell-bottom pants. The white t-shirt. The white Simon. Everything. <laughs> oh, that you is get everything. It. You know what? <laughs> yeah. I am going to give you that point. That is everything. I am giving you that point. What do you think, audience? They deserve that point. That's pretty much all that Simon wears. Sophia. You, you did so much magic in two and a half minutes that I don't even know what I was seeing. You made me believe in magic. This is amazing. This was better than your audition. And I really want to know what Simon thinks. Simon, did he win you over? I think I helped you. No. I do. I really, really do. I the think magic that, Simon. no, by me saying no at the auditions, I think has pushed you to be a better magician. <laughs> and I'm very happy to say on live television, I am officially an idiot. Yeah! No. Howie! You know, we, I, I want to say this from, from my heart here. Uh, what you have done for the show and as a friend, as one of the most amazing people I've ever worked with, oh, wow. I wanted 
to pay you a tribute to show your significance and most importantly your importance for the 10 years you've been on the show. Over to you, Terry. Hey, it's out on Sunset Boulevard. Okay, let's take a look. Here we go. Count it down with me, people. Where am I looking? Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs>